Another round of thunderstorms could make its way this evening into western Massachusetts. Let's take a look at how these thunderstorms form in the first place. First thing we need, which you've definitely felt today, is those warm temperatures. As the ground warms up, we're going to see that moist air start to rise. Now, as it starts to do it more so throughout the day, it starts to form these clouds. And with unstable conditions, these clouds are able to grow a lot taller and, again, a lot more unstable, lending itself to more thunderstorm activity. Now, as the evening hours go on, which is when a lot of these thunderstorms tend to form, we're going to start seeing this instability, and that is also what causes that lightning. Once that thunderstorm runs out of that warm, moist air as the evening hours go on and temperatures start to drop, it will start to go downwards in volume, and the thunderstorms will start to end. Now, the most important thing to know is lightning safety during these thunderstorms. You're going to want to take shelter in a fully enclosed building. Stay away from any windows. You want to stay as in the center of your house or whatever building you're in as possible. Definitely no electronics that are plugged into the wall. That includes those corded phones, and you're going to want to also stay out of the shower or bath. Water will conduct electricity enough to make it hurt a lot more than you'd appreciate. You're also going to want to stay out of any large bodies of water outside, but I think that went without saying by going in an enclosed building. And as the saying goes, when ro thunder roars, go indoors. Working for you, I'm Jack Wu with the 22 News Storm Team.